Coach Brad Laird, uh, the Demon football schedule for 2019 is out. What are your uh, reactions to a 12-game schedule playing LSU and Tiger Stadium and uh, another tough Southland Conference slate? Well, it's exciting. You know, you come off signing date, which is always a very exciting time of the year, and and uh, and you get back focused on on your football team as as we were able to have our first county fair this morning, and leads into. Uh, the, the, the 2019 schedule as, as we're looking to see what this football team's about. And, and you look at the schedule, I mean, a couple things you look at. One is a 12-game season, uh, always exciting uh, in FCS. Uh, you know, this is, I think it was five years ago, the last time we had the opportunity to play a 12-game schedule with an open date. So excited about that. You know, we're going to start on a Thursday night with uh, a new FCS opponent in UT Martin and, and be able to end on a Thursday night at home against Southland Conference rival Stephen F. Austin. And, you know, you look in there in between and you see a, a LSU week three, uh, the opportunity for this football team, uh, Northwestern State University, uh, from the cheerleaders, the band, the community, the university, to be able to go into Tiger Stadium uh, and compete in, in one of the biggest venues in the state of Louisiana. But, but what adds to that, I think, is, is Coach Orzron. Uh, the legacy that he left here at Northwestern State as a player and, and what he's become and what he's done at LSU to go in uh, against a football team that most likely going to be top 10 in the nation. So our football team's excited about, about that. Uh, you know, five, uh, five home games starting with Midwestern State. Uh, the success they've had over the last 20 years uh, is very evident. And then four uh, home conference games uh, with, uh, with UCA. Uh, coming in here as homecoming. So, you know, really excited about the 12-game season and really to, to see what this football team's about. You've got a schedule that uh, is certainly challenging, but as you look at the conference race, last year shows you anything can happen. Uh, UIW and Lamar both go to the playoffs. Uh, previously really hadn't been contenders in the conference. Your team was three points away from winning season last year. So you've got to feel very optimistic about uh, what can happen in 2019. No doubt. I think that's what the Southland Conference is about. Uh, year in and year out, you're, you're going to have an opportunity uh, to do what a Lamar did, uh, do what a UIW did last year. And, and, and we look forward to that opportunity, uh, just like uh, all Southland Conference do, teams do at the beginning of the year. But uh, it's just proven in the past that uh, take care of business week in and week out, and, and you never know. Uh, at the end of the day, where are you going to be? It, it doesn't matter about preseason rankings. Uh, it matters where you are at the end of the year. And we look forward to the process that we go through to see where we will end up.